I'm Dr. Ryan Stanton and the doc is in. The summer has hit hard. We have temperature spiking as well as the humidity. That also means the potential for heat related illness from heat cramps to heat stroke and everything in between. In the emergency departments, we've been seeing a number of patients coming in from all of those symptoms and significant risk for long term damage and even death. With higher humidities and higher temperatures, it means our body cannot regulate as well, especially when complicated by comorbid medical conditions or environments where people may be higher at risk. The most important thing here is to keep Keep some tips in mind. First and foremost, stay well hydrated. This is even before the activities or exposure to heat. Make sure that you take plenty of breaks, avoiding the hottest part of the day. Take advantage of those morning hours and late evening. Finally, check in on your neighbors. Many of the complications that we see may involve folks in areas with insufficient air conditioning or folks that may be stuck outside. So check in on neighbors, keep things in check, and get folks help when they need it. You can join the conversation on our Doc is in Facebook page and at Everyday Med on Twitter. I'm Dr. Ryan Stanton, and the Doc is out.